Hey guys, welcome back to Ultimate Gaming. Today we're going to be looking at a game called Luna's Fishing Garden. It is definitely not my, my standard game. It is a lot more casual and cutesy, which doesn't make it a bad game in any way. And I like to broaden my gaming horizon, try some new things. And I know there's some guys and girls out there that, that like some of the more <laughs> casual, friendly type of games, as you can see. It's very relaxing and calm. Let's let's find out what the heck this game's all about, what we're getting ourselves into here. With Luna's Fishing Garden. This is right out of this happened. It's storm. Did we fail to fight it off? So she got swept up and like thrown on a random island? Alright, how do I play? Alright, they kind of just throw us in there real quick. Let's take a look at the options for a sec. Uh, so we can play mouse only, keyboard or gamepad, that's cool. Button hits, mouse only controls, lock cursor in full screen mode, simple fishing. Huh. I might play with the setting a little bit and see what the heck that's all about. Graphics, uh, pretty simple stuff. Your resolution. Sync. That's all you really need for this type of game. There's sound settings, which I turned down a little bit. Back, back. Pause the game. Alright, buddy, what are you all about? Why is this human in my garden? Is it Cassie? Cassie, you say. I asked you why, not who. If I had any power left in me, I'd cast you away in an instant. That storm scattered debris and destruction all across my island. What can I do? Now think, Luna. Oh, you're still here. Well, human, if you want to make yourself useful, gather up any scrap you see, and I might use what little magic I have left to help you. Moon is not so bad. Clean up. Okay. Suppose that will do. Take this. Magic leaves. You can now sell your items to Luna. Let's see if I can. Behold! Floating weed. See how Joey being. I like to know how that old sea dog fared. He lives on the next island to the east. He's a master fisherman, so expect a lesson or two from him, which is good news for you, because if you want my help, I'll need fish. Lots of fish. Cool. Uh, okay, that's my boat. I guess I gotta learn. It's a big seal. Oh, I'm picking up the scrap. Oh. Kinda goes fast. Okay. So I'm picking up the scrap. Let's see, how do I, uh... Okay, I need to use the docks to get on the island. That whole tree is scrap. Oh, a little fishy le fleshy leg friend. That bar was the storm of the century, I tell you. So I'm gonna send you over to check up on me. Well, uh, this hefty seal's still in peace. Here, this is for you, so you can a few times. I can count. Fishing rod. Value, good stuff. Um, and let her know all Jamie's doing just fine. Okay, cool. Let's see. Alright, fishing mode. You want an extra challenge now and then. Line up the vertical bar until the fish with the fish until the meter fills up to catch it. You just want to relax. Reel the line, reel the line in while the fish is calm and release it while the fish is struggling, or else the line will snap. Okay, so none of this is like automatic. You still have to work on it. Let's see. Tap the button when the fish is above, okay? Oh, I see the green bar on the right is actually going up. I thought I had to like try to keep that uh, big bar up. I got B. Look how happy she is. It's kind of cute. Do simple fishing and maybe up the speed, see what it looks like. Oh, well, that's definitely, uh, that's definitely more enjoyable. I up the speed the max too, so I'm guessing this, this is going a lot faster than it normally goes. I suppose I should try the other mode out one more time at this speed, right? Let's try it out. Let's see what it's like. Oh, I see. So I don't have to, 
like just hit space while the fit. Okay, I get you. So I was trying to. What the? Whoa! Let's go back to the other method. I'm pretty sure I can't fish that quickly with, with that other mode on. Let's try this again. <laughs> That's pretty funny. So you clean up, you clean up the scrap, you do the fishing, the inventory's full. Alright. Task list. Alright, so I turned in the fish. Is that fish I smell? Good, I need to restore my energy. Okay, we're gonna compare it to what it used to be. It's not much of a garden item. Oh, here we go. Now we get the plant, of course, right? Got, we gotta do planting in a casual game like this. Magic seed pouch. Good people help those in need. Surely an able bodied human like yourself can bring a little life back to these islands. Start by planting at least one cattail and bringing me three cattail seeds. I could use a hand clearing more debris from the island. Start with the nearby island. I don't know exactly how much your little human hands can handle, so I hope that's simple enough. Okay. Okay, so I sold everything and paid me in leaps. I'm definitely more of your combat type of dude, but but like I said, I like to I like to try different things. I like to broaden my horizon. Horizons. It's cute. My, my girlfriend and fiance would would enjoy this one. I think I'll probably end up buying it for her. Let's see. What are we looking at? Plant and build. So we're gonna plant. Oh, 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 the lotus goes in the water. Okay, that makes sense, right? I don't know my plants. Okay, so that intersects with the lotus. I can't plant it. My inventory is full. 12 out of 12. So I don't know what the cattail does exactly in the lotus, but... It's like a generated, uh... stuff. Okay, so let's sell the scrap again. So they cost leaves to plant. Oh, there's trees and stuff. There's... You see that? Like, plus 30 leaves every 45 seconds. So that's the currency. But what's our gold here? Are those done? Oh yeah, look. Lotus seed, cattail seed. So do you sell those? You probably sell them. I can't do any trees yet. So we'll plant another uh, lotus. This is kind of cute. It's funny, I come from like playing some, uh, some of your more difficult games, like your your Souls like games and stuff, and then playing something like this. I play all sides, there's all sorts of uh, games, all sorts of uh, different things. Not a fan of sports games. Pretty much that. If I stay away from uh, sports games, I'm generally happy. Let's see. That, oh, we got this guy giving a quest again. Alright, what do you want? Okay, so this dude wants... What? Mackerel? Oh, he wants cattail seeds, the other dude. This dude wants mackerel. It's kind of cute. Catfish. Feel for the real achievement. 
failed. This game's too hard for me. Imagine raging at this game. If you rage quit at this game, you got a serious problem. <laughs> It's like the opposite of what you should be doing when you're playing this game. This is so like laid back and relaxing. Although me personally, I, I get my relaxing out of killing people in PvP and MMOs. I don't know, that's like relaxing to me. Take my frustrations out on, on PvP. But I definitely understand how this is like. You know, after a long day of work or something, people like to sit back and chill with something like this. I can, I can get that. I can definitely understand that. I wonder if I should go to this other location here. Might get different results. But maybe they, I'll get that mackerel uh, more often here. Oh, I just lost it. You see the fishing pole turns red? Oh, a goldfish. That's a difficult catch. Oh, I, I, I keep trying to um, go too quickly towards the end. Breadfish! What the heck is a breadfish? Can I sell the fish to him? Oh, look at that. Fishing rod upgrades. Alright, that's cool. Makes our fishing lives easier. So we should be able to sell to him. Let's go get some fishing rod upgrades. What's up, bro? Um, give me a handle. Oh, that's all I can get. I could have got the real, but like, what if I just really quickly. I think it's not taking as much like a durability neon tetra. You see like the uh, it's not getting red nearly as easy. It's going back to green quite quickly. Oh yeah, I definitely uh, I can tell that this is quite a bit simpler. I'm supposed to get two mackerel. Isn't that like a. Uh, like some people having like little fish bowls and stuff? I don't know, I'm not an expert on fish. Some ones I had when I was a kid, the uh. You always see them at like the fairs and stuff, you know, like the little like. But a uh. No, no, not goldfish, but like the uh. A little more colorful. Though, you know, it's like a. It's pretty. Oh, this one, mackerel.
betta fish just came to me. That's what they were called. It should be alpha fish too. They're just bigger. Time is passing and I'm just sitting back relaxing, catching some fish. This, this is actually, I, I could really see why some people enjoy these type of games. I could understand it. Like I said, it's definitely not like my, my normal style of games, but I can definitely, I could see it. I've played some games that are a little more casual friendly, like, um, and I actually enjoyed them for real. Like, this is, this is definitely not bad. Um, I forgot the name of the game, but it was, um, like a garden type of sim where you're just planting stuff and you're upgrading your garden, getting more, more plants and such. And you plant more and earning more currency the more you plant is it's kind of chill. Apparently I got two mackerel, I didn't even notice. Alright. Really in two minnows. Where did I... Okay, I got minnows here before. Let's do it. I'm supposed to go see a lighthouse. I want to see what that's all about, too. So there's definitely a lot of fishing in this game, but I mean, it's probably because that's how I'm playing. I don't know. If I go out there and explore a bit more, I'm sure I'll find some stuff. Let's let's check out the, uh, the lighthouse and see what's up with this. It's locked up tight. Oh, I gotta get a... I gotta go back and talk to Luna. Let's go. Monkeys! Some friends of mine just showed up. They're murky. If anyone has a spare key, it's them. Okay. A human! The three monketeers? Athos. Could you bring us some bananas? Monkey three, monkey do. That's the name of my quest. Okay. I don't know where the heck I'm supposed to get bananas, but I imagine I can plant the banana tree. Ha uh ha! -huh. There we go. I wonder if you can like expand your uh, your land that you can plant on later. I wonder if you can plant on these land. Uh, can you just like plant? You can. You can plant these anywhere. It doesn't have to be on that left island. Pearl clam. That's good. So I can plant more stuff, sell, and then fish, and then go back. I'm supposed to get minnows. So let's get ourselves two minnows, and then go back to the left. And we'll. Uh, of our planted stuff. I'm not gonna, like, a lot of you guys know I work from home, but I do some gaming when work gets slow sometimes. I get to I have the opportunity to do some gaming, and having some, like, games that just are chill, laid back, and I don't have to think too much while I'm gaming mid, you know, going back and forth between a game and work. It's, it's actually nice. It's, it can be pretty nice at times. Who wants two breadfish? Alright, we know where those are, right? So we gather this. They want six bananas. I wonder if this is only to give one. It did only give one. Alright, so I definitely want to up my banana trees. More bananas. Why do they have an exclamation? Oh, okay. I turned in the one I had. Didn't it say... Oh, the pearl clam is... better than the other stuff. So these things definitely grow a lot quicker. Can I plant a banana tree from here? I don't even have enough to plant another one. Alright, we're gonna go for the breadfish. Is that a real fish? Oh, there's a fish. I don't know. Like I said, I'm not, I, don't, I don't know my fish. 
sea bream. Lost it again at the end there. Good fish. <laughs> Look how happy she is when she catches a fish. Alright, there's our bread fish. Here you go, buddy. Oh, you got another quest? What else you want? More stuff? Two goldfish. Wait, I already have two goldfish here. Alright, he's done for now. Let's go collect our other stuff. second. There's the cattail. Bananas! Oh, lotus! Oh, this one come up any second now? Looks like those are gonna be like eggs or something. Every 45 seconds. Lotus, Lotus. Inventory full. I have to go back. Alright, one more banana and we're done. Thank God this hill is quick like that, you know? It sells the whole inventory rather than having a bit of quick, 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 quick. Because there's no reason to hold on to anything, it seems, in this game, which actually makes it quite simple to play very easy. I wonder if like the world's gonna expand or anything beyond what you see like, to the sides as you progress. It is a pretty huge game though. Game, and this comes from someone who got rank 14 high warlord, right? No one's gonna know what that is. You guys that do, maybe you'd be like, wow, that's, that's a pretty big 180 on, on what games you're playing. Cleaning up the scrap. Like I said, I try everything. Keep in mind, this is with a 3090 in my computer. I'm still playing this. Extend the lighthouse's reach. Oh, so it looks like we are gonna extend our, uh, our island. Mm -hmm. Almost have enough. Let's see. Let's get us a fish and sell it. it. Should bring us close to 250. There we go, Guppy. Alright. <laughs> 249.
researcher. Seven unique items. Why? Do fish count as, as items? Oh, it's one of those things. Those, those, it's very slow to react. Things. I don't think they're fish, though, right? They're like a... I don't know what you call them. Close to a reptile, I think? Or something like that? Because they got little feet. Oh, look, a beta fish. We were talking about that earlier. Black bass. Just, just like catalog. I was like, oh, thank you so much for the unique items that I will not pay you for. I didn't add any of these to this uh, dude, so if I get three different fish here, that should be all we need to do. I think that's three different, right? Yeah. Let's go add that. Space is always great. Yes, it's my favorite. What do you want? Five new specimen. So, more unique items, and he wants us to go to the lighthouse. Or we'll extend that reach further. Alright, guys, well, that's probably gonna be the end of this. Um, I'll do my opinions on it. Uh, Definitely not my style of game. Not not my personal style, but I can see how this can definitely be a game right up someone's alley that, you know, it's something calming, relaxing. You don't have to think, don't have to worry about dying in combat. This this could definitely be someone's stuff. It reminds me of like Lemonade Tycoon type of stuff back in the day, you know? It's like you kinda just play. You just play and, and not have to think too much behind it. And and it's nice that there's games like this out there. It suits um a certain player base, some people that like the more approachable games. They don't have to really uh, stress themselves out and give them, give it their all to uh, to accomplish something. Again, not my style, but I understand um, why people would like this, and I definitely think it's a it's a charming little game, nice and calming. Anyway, guys, I hope you guys uh, enjoyed enjoyed Luna's Fishing Garden. You can find that thing on Steam. This game is going to be released today the day i post this video so hopefully you guys uh enjoyed that video and if you're looking for more content such as this on upcoming games new games indie games love doing indie games and stuff go ahead and uh hit that sub hit that like button and uh leave a comment on what you think below thank you very much for watching i'll catch you guys in the next video Skidat!